how you good dog guys doing i am here it's niecy's review so i'm going to review some drinks um some sea mouse drinks i never ever had sea mouse um i guess in a natural state nor gel um I might have had it in pill form. I'm not sure. But, um, you know what? No, I haven't. I wanted to get them in pen, in pill form, but I did it. So, um, but this is going to be my first time ever drinking, tasting sea moss. And this, there's this new company out. Um, uh, I'm just now seeing it at least. Um, it's Royalty Sea Moss. Um, I saw it on Facebook. Um, and those drinks looked it tasty. You know, very colorful. So they're like lemonade drinks, but they're um had they got sea moss in it. So if you're interested in getting some yourself, you can go to is that logo if you can't pull it up um or if you'll like if you pull it up you're like hmm is this the company yes just look for their logo okay it's called again royalty cmos and the website is royaltycmos.com okay so make sure you go there on um instagram facebook tiktok and twitter okay so you guys check that out so i brought three different juices this one is pineapple this one is i think it's blue raspberry i believe and like in this one you could actually it's, it's got something going on in there you gotta make sure you shake it up and this one is green apple I'm going to taste all three of these tonight on this live right now and tell you what I um, think of it. So back back history um, with me, I suffer. I was diagnosed with um, Graves disease back in 2007, I believe. I was um, diagnosed with graves disease so i have thyroid issues i took an iodine pill that's the same size as my pinky in my throat so it destroyed my thyroid gland and if you don't know what the thyroid is or where it's located it's located right here and if you look at a muscle of your body or you know your body or whatever it's still a butterfly shaped okay and that my dears is the most important that little tiny that little tiny gland is the most important gland in your body most people think it's your heart most people think it's your brain but without this lovely gland here your heart or your your brain won't be working Cause it sends out your hormones, right? Say, hey, this, hey, you need to send some hormones down here. Hey, you need to put something down here. Hey, you're hurting down there. Okay, so that's what this little small gland does. Of course, mine was hyper. I was diagnosed with hyperthyroidism, um, meaning in layman's terms, I was a little bit thin girl and was eating you out of house and home but wasn't gaining no weight okay and you see how big and bulge my eyes are yeah that's what the graves disease did to me because i never had these growing up and you see my neck is all bulgy right here i if i didn't get um the iodine peel i would have had a water because um, that's when they looked at it and they was like, thank you, you're about to get a gorder or whatever. So, yeah. And those things, I know you've probably seen people 
older people maybe um with those big old necks and everything and you're like what is that is that a tumor no it's not a tumor i don't know it's just an inflation of your neck it's getting bigger but it starts to choke you yeah so as it get bigger and as it grows it can choke and you can lose breath you know so and die so now I'm on medication for the rest of my life. So if I'm taking off that medication, yes, my dears, I will be put into a coma, a coma and possible death. Okay, so I'm on, as you can see, I am big now. I'm a 220. Got to get used to it. and But I'm trying to lose it. So now that I've, gotten i took the iodine pill i am now considered hypo and um that's when you gain weight as you can tell it's easy to gain weight like i can't do like i used to do when i was in high school and just eat all types of candy eats all types of food and never gain oh any type of pound um no I will gain every last bit of that pound. <laughs> okay. So that's my back end story. Um, a little short version of it. Um, <clears throat> so now let's get into this. So I've always heard um, people at my church. This is at my church was um, I was in a group um, of ladies who are authors and that was just inspiring. And one lady in there, she suffers for a thyroid. And she was telling the whole group about sea moss and how it helps with your thyroid thyroid issues. Like she's not on medication. Um so she's been doing the um any type of sea moss stuff or whatever. So uh it's been helping her out. So right now in this video, I'm only doing the taste testing. Um, I'm going to try to continue to buy some of these um, for at least probably like six months or whatever to see how, because it's like freshly June. So for six months, June, July, August, September, October, November, November, I hopefully will still have been continuing these and go to a doctor and to see how my thyroid levels have been right now they're you know they are in that okay stage like uh my levels aren't that high put it like that okay so first up is my favorite i love pineapple so let's try this pineapple here this is um the royalty Seamoss lemonade this is pineapple and it has 10 calories in it if you're counting your calories um no sugars got um seven grams of sodium um so no fat at all so we no protein no fiber what do we get <laughs> all right let's try it Ooh, might taste good. This is, oh my goodness, just the smell of it is good. This is not, y'all, this, this is straight up pineapple um drink. What's the pineapple drink, y'all? No. Oh. Is it sun kiss? That's what it tastes like. This ain't no lemonade. This is pineapple drink. Uh that's how that's how it tastes. No lie. No lie. All right. I'm gonna go with this one. Cause see, in the videos that I was seeing, the advertising videos, they were like, oh no, the the blue, the blue, the blue. So this is blue raspberry, okay? Or raspberry. We can see it is blue. All right. 
Angus or I'm not that fond of it, but it's 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 worth drinking. You can taste the lemonade in this one. This one is kind of tart, like sour. Ugh. Okay, this is the green apple now. Let's see. Oh. 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 Oh my goodness. Somebody give me a Jolly Rancher because this is what it tastes like. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. So, uh, so far. These two are my favorite, okay? This one here is doable. I, I'm going to drink it, of course. But, yeah, it's doable. I I don't think I would like um, blue raspberries, any type of blue raspberry stuff um, that well. But I'm going to drink it, of course. I brought it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But these two right here, <laughs> these two right here, my babies. Okay, yes, yes, yes. So that it that concludes my review on the royal, royal, royal excuse me, royal tea, sea moss lemonades. So come again, um, next time to for my review and go ahead, like, share. And subscribe to this video. Thank you once more.